Hey guys, so a once in a lifetime opportunity and that's what coronavirus has presented us. I mean, never before have so many people been stuck at home and the only person they can really deal or speak to and be with is themselves, you know? I mean, sure you might have family there and you might have husband and, and kids and all that sort of stuff or wife and kids, you know, but the reality is, is you are stuck in your small little unit you know, and very rarely, I mean, work allows us to keep so busy that we don't take time out to, you know, really focus on the things that we want with our life, our real goals, our real purpose. And I think the, the, the opportunity that we've got here now is that we can redefine what it is and what makes us, us, you know, what makes you, you. And really, I think, you know, you can redefine what it is, what, you know, work, you know, what the work you really want to do, the career you really want to have, you know, your finances, your health, you know, even down to little things like, you know, your relationship with social media, you know, whether that be you're too involved in it or you're resisting it and actually it's something you need to get involved with. You know, I know that's certainly the case for myself. You know, what, what this has done is it allows me, you know, I'm doing two or three videos a day plus another two or three videos for you know various people in various you know parts of the business and you know it's really allowed me to I guess just focus you know and I was quarantined for 14 days in that 14 days I had to sit down and really look at things because not only have we got various businesses around the world you know I work long hours I do you know lots of work and things like that but the reality is I had to re-look at each of those and work out you know, if it's really what I wanted, if it was really working now and in the future, because I think things are going to change in the future. We've been moving towards AI and we've been moving towards automation and we've been moving towards, you know, social media and all these sort of things, but a lot of businesses are still stuck in the dark ages. And there's elements of every business that is like that. There's elements of every person's life that is like that. And so I guess my challenge to you today and for the next, you know, whether it be two weeks, two months, or however long this coronavirus stuff goes on for is, you know, you've got a once in a lifetime opportunity. This is unlikely to happen again, and maybe it will. You know, maybe there'll be another hundred year virus, you know, but I think the reality is you have the opportunity to redefine right now who you are and your relationship with whatever it is, whatever relationship that is. And I think that's key, you know. Look, there's no, no need to be sitting there worried and stressed about what might happen. You, for the most part, you cannot control that. You have no control over the virus. You have no control over the government and what they decide. You have to work with what you've got right now. And the reality is worrying and stressing about these things isn't going to help. But setting goals, you know, sitting down and really working and taking stock of where you are right now, where you expect it to be, where you want to be, you know, looking at what resources you've got that you can call upon, whether that be relationships or finances or whether that be whatever it is, your experience, you know, it doesn't matter, you know, setting those goals and, and really while you're locked away in your home and not able to go out and, you know, create a daily routine. So get up at the same time, go to bed at the same time. Don't get caught just, you know, watching lots and lots of Netflix and going through every single thing. That is not going to help you. That will steal this opportunity from you. You know, sorry, Netflix, if you're there, you know, but the reality is, you know, there are so many other things you can be doing and so many other things you can be focusing on and really advancing and taking forward. And, you know, there's not the distractions, you know, there's not the millions of emails coming in from all different, you know, the work and things like that. A lot of that has slowed down massively. Now, if you're still at work, fine. You know, what you'll find is things are you know, settling down a bit now and they will probably settle down over the coming weeks and potentially month, two months, whatever. But, you know, if you create a daily routine where you put aside time, and I think that's the key, setting aside time for goals, setting a time time for things like, you know, if you want to get a qualification, there's so many things to do online. There's so many things to be done virtually, you know, that you can do. If there's friends you've been wanting to chat to for ages, you know, house party or Zoom or call them up, um, WhatsApp, whatever the, you know, the app you use is, get in and use it. Yeah? But more and most importantly, take action. Don't let another week go by. Don't let the month go by. Don't miss this opportunity to change your life in whatever direction that is. You know, now I know it's stressful and I know there are things you've got to worry about. And I know it's, you know, do I have a job at the end of this? Is my business going to survive? You know, you know, is someone close to me going to get coronavirus and perhaps get really ill? You know, am I going to do that? Are my kids going to do that? There's all these sort of stress and worries. But if you focus on those, 
Yeah, you will waste this opportunity. You need to focus on the positive and you need to look beyond this because it won't take too long and coronavirus will be in our past and the past is best left behind us. You know, now you've got an opportunity to redefine whatever it is you want. So take that opportunity, yeah? There's so much opportunity out there, there's so much, you know? And, and, and a lot of that is online. Jump online and go and f- explore you, you know, join a community, get that mentorship or that support for whatever it is you want to do. And whether that be as simple as something, you know, you want to get your next qualification at work and you're going to keep the same career and you're going to keep the same job. Or maybe it is you haven't really explored how to use social media in your business. Go and explore that. There's so many free courses out there now. There's so much ability to do and it doesn't have to cost you anything. Yeah? And you can set aside the time, lock yourself away in a room and learn that. It's extraordinary what the opportunity is. And you know, if we look for those opportunities, you know, our businesses, you know, if you're a business owner like myself, you can sit there and go, I've been heading in this direction, but we can now get a chance to pivot in this direction, you know, and maybe you keep that direction, but maybe that's on hold right now. I've got a sales business, I've got a property sales business. Nothing is happening in property sales right now. Yeah, nobody wants to make decisions, they want to see where things are going. Yeah, so we've put that on hold, yeah, and we're focusing on property education. So part of why I'm doing so many videos is because I'm getting back into the habit of providing this information. But you know, this is the sort of stuff where you can pivot. You know, taking advantage of the opportunity and redefining what it is, what life means to you and the various aspects of life. You know, guys, and if you do that, you'll look back on this coronavirus as one of the best things that ever happened to you and your career and your relationships. Yeah. Now, sure, you know that's not denying the human tragedy. You know, that, that's there, but you don't have to focus on that. You can define your own relationship with this coronavirus opportunity. All right, guys, have a great day. Stay safe. Stay healthy. And right now, stay at home. All right, guys. See you later. Bye.